Let us solve more difficult question which is related to separable equation and the first one dy over dx we have 1 over 1 minus x square and 1 plus y so we know that what c is separable in front of dx just x in front of dy just y so here let's send this x on the right side y minus x square dy equal 1 plus y dx in front of dx just term of x there must be term of x so send this one to right and this one to left side as cross product 1 over 1 plus y dy 1 over 1 minus x square dx so the in front of dx x in front of dy y and this is separable let's take integral of course this is easy 1 over 1 plus y it's equal ln but this is not easy so for this type we can factorize denominator 1 minus x square we can factorize that's why we should use partial fraction for that integral 1 over 1 minus x square we know that this is 1 over 1 minus x 1 plus x so a over 1 minus x b over 1 plus x to find a b we have to equalize denominator by 1 plus x by 1 minus x so it's equal a 1 plus x b 1 minus x over 1 plus x 1 minus x so for that part we have to equalize num numerator here there is 1 in numerator here a 1 plus x b 1 plus minus 1 minus x to find a b in a quick way of course you can equalize the coefficient which comes from equality of polynomial you can find but by making the coefficient zero you can find a b here for example for x equal minus 1 this part 0 minus 1 1 minus minus 1 2 b equal 1 so b equal 1 over 2 to make it this part 0 for x equal 1 if x equal 1 if x equal 1 1 equal here if x equal 1 2 a so a is also 1 over 2 so let's write again this equal integral 1 over 1 plus y dy and this integral 1 over 1 minus x square a over b over so a 1 over 2 1 over 2 over 1 minus x here be 1 over 2 over 1 plus x because we calculate a and b as 1 over 2 so let's take integral 1 over 1 plus 1 ln 1 plus y here 1 over 2 ln 1 minus x here 1 over 2 1 over 1 plus x ln 1 plus x as well and what we said before previous video if all of them logarithmic function instead of c put ln c to remove all logarithmic function this is ln 1 plus y we know that if it is coefficient we can write inside as power ln 1 minus x to the power of 1 over 2 here same things ln 1 plus x to the power of 1 over 2 send here ln c so ln 1 plus y here if we have logarithmic function as addition we can write in one logarithmic function as multiplication ln 1 minus x to the power of 1 over 2 1 plus x to the power of 1 over 2 times c all ln as multiplication now we removed ln this is 1 plus y if you want you can multiply this absolute value is 1 minus x square 1 over 2 or you can write as square root times c this is our result 1 minus x 1 plus x equal 1 minus x square the power same that's why i wrote to the power of 1 over 2 or square root so this is a good question for us to use partial fraction don't don't suppose that always 
easy integral. Sometimes you can use partial fraction substitution integration by part, something like that. So th that was a good question. And the second one here, first of all, to say separable, we have to separate term of x and y here. They are not separate, but we can do something. x dy dx, we have to separate them because separable equation says that in front of dy, y in front of dx, x. But the term of x and y together here, they are not separated. So, 3 plus x square, here is y square is common factor, y square 3 plus x square. So, x dy over dx. Here you see 3 plus x square, 3 plus x square is common factor, 3 plus x square. Here, if there is nothing, it means 1. Here, we have y square. If you say there is nothing in common factor, it means 1. So, let's send dx to this side, x dy, 3x square, 1 plus y square dx. You see, this is problem for us because in front of dx, there will be no another variable. In front of dy, there will be no another variable. Let's send this to right side and this to left side as cross product. 1 over 1 plus y square dy equal 3 plus x square over x dx. So it is equal 1 over 1 plus y square dy. Let's divide into part 3 over x plus x square over x is x. And a common mistake, silly mistake, but be careful about this x square over x you say x x and third three plus x no this is not be careful you have addition and you have to separate in two parts so in front of dy y in front of dx x so take integral let's take integral so this is separable what is the integral 1 over 1 plus y square 1 over 1 plus x square it was arctan x so this is arctan y and here 3 what's the integral of 1 over x ln x what's the integral of x x square over 2 and don't forget to put plus c and this is our solution so sometimes maybe uh, the integral could be difficult or sometimes the term of x and y together they are not separated and we must separate it and these two questions are so important for us.